share and spread the soil knowledge with soilbooks.com Soil is alive. It's a whole world of tiny creatures and nutrients that help our plants grow strong and healthy. But there's a secret ingredient that can make or break your garden's success. Soil pH. Think of pH as a measure of how acidic or alkaline your soil is. It's like a scale that tells us if our soil is too sour or too sweet for our plants. Just like we need the right balance of food, plants need the right pH level to absorb all the good stuff from the soil. Getting the pH right is essential, whether you're growing prize-winning roses or a vegetable patch bursting with flavor. So let's dig a little deeper and uncover the secrets of soil pH together. Imagine a seesaw, with acidic soil on one side and alkaline soil on the other, right in the middle is neutral soil. We measure this balance using the pH scale, which runs from 0 to 14. Numbers below 7 mean the soil is acidic, like the tangy taste of a lemon. Numbers above 7 mean the soil is alkaline, similar to the bitterness of baking soda. And a pH of 7? That's neutral, like pure water. Most plants prefer a slightly acidic to neutral pH, somewhere between 6 and 7. But some plants like things a little more tart or a tad sweeter. Understanding the pH scale is key to unlocking your garden's full potential. Why is pH so important for our leafy friends? Well, it all comes down to nutrients. The building blocks plants need to grow strong roots, vibrant flowers, and delicious fruits. When the pH is off, these nutrients get locked away in the soil, like treasures in a locked chest. Plants can't access them no matter how hard they try. It's like trying to eat soup with a fork. Frustrating and ineffective, but when the pH is just right, the treasure chest swings open. Nutrients become readily available and plants can feast to their heart's content. This means healthier plants, tastier veggies, and more beautiful blooms for you to enjoy. Just like we have our favorite foods, different plants thrive in different pH levels. Some plants are quite adaptable and tolerate a range of pH conditions. Others are fussier eaters and need a specific pH to truly flourish. For instance, blueberries and rhododendrons love acidic soil, like a refreshing glass of lemonade on a hot day. They'll sulk and refuse to flower if the soil is too alkaline. On the other hand, lavender and clematis prefer a sweeter, more alkaline environment, like a sprinkle of sugar in their tea. Knowing the pH preferences of your plants is like having a secret weapon in your gardening arsenal. It allows you to create the perfect growing environment for each plant to reach its full potential. Section 5. Testing the waters, knowing your soil. So, how do you know what your soil pH is? Don't worry, it's easier than you might think. There are a couple of ways to test your soil's pH. DIY methods, home pH testing kits. You can pick up a simple pH testing kit from your local garden center. These kits usually involve mixing a small soil sample with a solution. pH is the first step towards creating the ideal growing environment for your plants. Section 6. Adjusting your pH, a balancing act. What if your soil's pH isn't quite right for your plants? Don't despair, we can adjust the pH to create a more hospitable environment. Lowering pH, making it more acidic, elemental sulfur. This natural mineral gradually lowers pH over time. Aluminium sulfate, works faster than sulfur but requires careful application. Organic matter, adding peat moss or composted pine needles can increase acidity, raising pH, making it more alkaline. Ground limestone, this is the most common material for raising pH. Wood ash, can raise pH but should be used sparingly. Oyster shell flour, a good source of calcium carbonate which neutralizes acidity. Remember, adjusting pH is a gradual process. It's important to retest your soil regularly to monitor the changes and make further adjustments as needed.
contributing to a healthier planet for generations to come. Section 8. Ready, Set, Grow, Soil pH. It's a small change with a big impact. By understanding the importance of pH, testing our soil and making necessary adjustments, we can unlock our garden's true potential. So grab your gardening gloves, get testing, and let's create thriving gardens full of flavor, color, and life.